spend the rest of my life with the same one, same one. Ain't no I and T. I'ma bring you good love, just come with me. Baby, you're all the company I need. Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It is your favorite girl, A Marie. And you guys, I went on a very small Ulta. I got on my phone, okay? I got on my phone and I ordered some things that just dropped and I needed to hurry up and do a haul so that I could hurry up and give you guys some reviews and first impressions and things like that. So if you wanna see what's in this small Ulta haul, then just keep watching. But before we go any further, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. That's it. Okay, you guys, so I didn't even make sure my full order was here. <laughs> I seen that Urban Decay had dropped a new foundation and you guys, I was like, because I'm wanting to make my channel better and elevate, you know, I needed to grab this foundation and do a review for you guys in a first impressions type of rare test type of video. Well, when I was on there getting that, you guys, I seen some new products that I was like, gotta get, gotta bring to the channel. I ordered this on, I ordered it on the 2nd, okay? And today is the 5th. Tell me that ain't dedication. I'm doing it all 2021. First item is the Urban Decay Stay Naked Tinted Hot, no, Tinted Glow Hydrator. This is a medium coverage up to 24 hour wear. I did do this shade match, which the shade match said that I was, I think a shade lighter than what I chose. So I thought to play it on the safe side and get the shade darker. I did get the shade 60 medium dark and I hope I did right. You guys know it's a hit and miss with me when it comes down to finding foundation which now I'm looking at it, I probably should have went two shades darker. Has a lot of claims and I haven't seen no reviews on it, which is good for me. But I am gonna, I'm just gonna squeeze out a little bit. You guys know I don't like to do this. Hopefully you could tell with that small dot. But we're not gonna talk about it. We're not gonna do anything until we do this foundation review. This was the product I was going after, so I need it it to give it to you guys because like i said i haven't seen any reviews or heard nobody talk about it if i come across any videos i'm not gonna watch them because i like to form my own opinion on it you know what i mean all right i decided to bring y'all in a little bit and i'm gonna raise my chair just a little bit because i feel like i'm a tad bit too low for comfort i got me some teamy detox Max. Okay, I got me a Teamy Detox Mask. This is the green tea blend with matcha, lemongrass, and clay. Let me tell y'all, Aaliyah's face, talk about this. Keisha Anderson, Keisha K. Lee, whichever one y'all know her as, talks about this. And my girl, Platinum D. All three ladies are on YouTube. Y'all should know who they are. If you don't, I will link their channels down below. But they all use this and they all love this mask. Keisha Anderson does have a coupon code or like a bundle with Timmy. Um, but I didn't buy it from there. I bought it from Ulta and it only is sold online at Ulta. Keisha is the only one who has a coupon code or a bundle or some deal like that. So I will link her um, affiliate link or her coupon code with this not mine at all give her the coin it won't come to me okay but i am so eager to try this because even platinum d said it does wonders for her skin and i know platinum does it every sunday so i'm super excited oh she's so creamy look oh and she smells fresh oh you guys i will be doing a skincare routine coming up shortly and maybe this will be in it i kind of want to do a skincare routine on the products that i normally use on my skin 
but I do use masks so maybe this will be involved I don't know yet but you guys will have to subscribe and turn your post notifications to all so that y'all won't miss that video because it is coming L'Oreal Infallible you guys know I love L'Oreal Infallible foundation the fresh wear this one right here y'all know this babe I can't get enough of her this one is in deep golden L'Oreal came out with the 24 hour foundation powder the powder sis like <laughs> I'm excited I do have the shade copper now one thing I noticed with this powder it didn't have a deep golden shade so I got copper and I hope I love this just like I love just like I love the foundation we will be doing a review on this as well so that's why I don't want to swipe it or anything like that so the next foundation I did see Andrea Renee review this but I can't tell you if I watched the whole thing or not um I think I was watching it when I was falling asleep which I need to go back and watch it but I'm only gonna go back and watch it after I do my video so that I can form my own opinion on it and this is the elf camo Camo CC cream and you guys all I know is Andrea said that it's supposed to be a full coverage CC cream I don't even like CC creams you guys I think CC creams for me personally are a waste it's a waste of my money it's a waste of my time because y'all know I like to y'all know I need I need to cover up some things okay so for this to be a full coverage CC cream I was like oh hell yeah I gotta try it I have to try it so this is a color correct and full coverage natural finish I did get the shade deep 540 in with neutral warm undertones I think I did pick my shade off of Andrea Renee a lot of the products that she tried especially when it comes down to foundations I normally get the shade range from her and we're close in skin tone but it says a neutral warm undertone you guys know I'm not a neutral undertone I have yellowish gold undertones so okay so moving on Revline came out with some new lippies and I actually like the way they're packaged like little candies so I picked up two shades just to start off because sometimes Revlon is like really a hit and miss when it comes to the lip products so they look like this you guys this is so cute so let's talk about this pink shade this nudie pink so I did get the shade 006 eyes on you and these are liquid lipsticks I can't wait to try it out hopefully they come out better than any of their products that they normally come out with she feels real moosey like a moose and it's pretty of course it smells real good so here is the second shade and this one is more of a brown nude so this one is in 003 into deep and y'all know I love me a nude so she looks like that oh yes oh she looks like it's something I'm gonna love already let me swatch it oh and they feel so moosey but they do look full coverage you guys I hope it dries down oh that's a beautiful chocolate all right the next thing I got Too Faced came out with these cute ass little minis okay so Too Faced came out with these new little minis and it says it smells like cinnamon hearts this one here this one here is light my fire and it says we we're a perfect match on the fly eyeshadow palette you guys super freaking cute I can't I can't with Too Faced you guys know I'm a sucker for Too Faced only because of the packaging you guys this palette is so up my alley I know we're in winter or whatever the case may be we're still with the you know great blues and grays and whites but y'all know I'm a sucker for these deep warm colors like oh I love it but she don't smell like cinnamon maybe when I start moving her around or whatever so I am gonna do a oops 
YouTube video with this uh, eyeshadow look as well as I'm going to do a IGTV with this. Too Faced, holla at your girl, okay? Holla at me. All right, and then the last two products, you guys, Morphe came out with skincare. I was like, yep, got to do it. Got to give it to you guys. But the thing is, I only got two of their products. So I did get the Total Softy Gel Moisturizer and then the Restart Detox Face Mask. You guys, I love, if you can't tell, I love detox things like detox wash, detox wipes, detox mask. I love it. I said I was going to do like a review for you guys and tell y'all if I see a difference or how I feel about it. I'm going to do like a week long review and then give you guys my thoughts at the end of the week. You know what I mean? So let me know if you guys want that or I'll just use it on my own because I bought it. So I'm going to use it. So this one here is the Morphe Total Softy Gel Moisturizer. And y'all, the lights is killing. So you guys, and it looks fancy. I love that. Let's just see. Let's just see. It's in the bottle as like a bluish tint. And it has like a milky look to it. But I thought it was going to be more like Neutrogena's moisturizer, but it feels watery like the gel moisturizers do. Yeah, you can see the difference. It feels good though. It feels real lightweight. Oh, and it has a cucumber smell. I'm here for it. Let me know if you guys want that video. So the last product, of course, is the Detox Mask. I can't put this out on my hand because it is a Detox Mask. But it says, oh, and it's purple. It's a Restart Detox Mask. Super freaking cute. Now, one thing I can say is Morphe on every last one of their products, it had two on it. So it wasn't like no one, two, three step like makeup forever in them. It's just they have the number two on them. But this is the Restart Detox Mask. And it says apply a thick, even layer to clean, clean dry skin. Leave for 10 minutes or until mask is completely dry. Starting at the edges, gently peel off and rinse with warm water. So this is like a peel off mask, which is interesting. Okay, it smells like a detox. Okay, so yeah, you guys let me know if you guys want this. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know down below in the comment section, which one would you like me to review first? Elf or Urban Decay? I'm going to give y'all the Urban Decay foundation review next and then I'm going to give you guys the elf CC cream after this I'm going to give y'all a makeup tutorial with this little cutie right here after the foundation reviews and then we're going to come back and review this powder with the foundation and concealer Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you made it to the end. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. Consider subscribing as well as clicking the notification bell. And let's have a discussion down below in the comments because you guys know I love talking to y'all. So until the foundation review, I will see y'all next time. Deuces. Trying to spend the rest of my life with my